Every day here at the Greater Cleveland Aquarium, our team of divers gets in the water and works hard to keep our exhibits clean. We use a number of different tools and techniques to help us. Here we have a diver who is carrying the underwater vacuum. The divers will move around the exhibit, closing hidden valves built into the decor. Before attaching the vacuum hose to the valve, where they will begin cleaning. The vacuum hose attaches to a carboy system, which the divers can remove, and a carburetor to control the strong suction power. The divers will use the end of the vacuum hose with its strong suction to suck up the leftover fish food and waste while leaving the sand, decor, and corals unbothered. Sometimes it can get really cloudy while vacuuming. The whole time the divers are working at scrubbing and vacuuming, the sharks and other animals are always swimming nearby. One of the diver's favorite animals is our porcupine pufferfish. He's often found hovering right next to the divers and supervising their work. As one diver works to vacuum, the other will focus on scrubbing the decor. Nearly anything the light touches will grow algae, so it is a constant struggle to stay ahead on our cleaning duties. While the divers may work on separate tasks, they are always close together and keeping tabs on one another. On almost all scuba dives, we have multiple people watching out for the divers, both from on top of the exhibits and in the sea tube. Diver safety is always our top priority. We find shark teeth and stingray teeth on nearly every single dive. Cow nose stingrays have teeth that are flat on one side and comb shaped on the other. They are good for crushing up the stingrays' favorite foods. We exit the exhibit the same way we entered, through a swim platform, and get ready to do it again tomorrow.